Hey guys, it's Chance. Back here again, and today, what? What? Hello, guys. It's <laughs> Torpedon. <laughs> so big. Today, I'm joined by Torpedon in yet another non-Euclidean build battle. If you didn't see my other video on this, here's a short snippet. Just walk. Uh, wee! Oh. So basically, we're having a build battle, and we have the immersive portals mod installed, which allows you to build insane builds. <laughs> the wide Putin meme. Oh my! <laughs> I'm right now trying to beat the YouTube algorithm, so if you enjoy this, don't forget to leave a like and a comment because it actually helps me out a ton. Like, let's be serious here for two seconds. Thank you guys, it means the world to me. All right, let's get into the video. I'm so much bigger than him, so uh, yeah. Did you say oh, you're bigger than me? Did you say you're bigger than me? Uh, 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 Did you say you're bigger? Uh, Torpedo. Yes. I'm gonna show you how this works, okay? Because you're not Jojo. So come here, my child. You have these portal helper blocks. And what you do is you build a portal of whatever size you want. Then you build another portal of same size. You connect them together by lighting it up. And kaboom! These two portals oh, are now connected. <laughs> I can't even jump up here. <laughs> you're <a> small <laughs> jump! <laughs> so me and Torpedon are gonna use this mod to make our uh, builds today, and uh, well, Torpedon, I also have a theme for you. Okay. Uh, the theme, awesome. the theme is lab. You can do whatever you want, whatever type of lab or sort of lab you want. It just has to be a lab. Let's start in three, two, one, go! All right, guys. So uh, yeah, as you can see, Jojo's not here with me today, which is kind of weird. I'm not used to this, but you know, Jojo also has a life outside of my YouTube channel. So, <laughs> but yeah, I brought my good friend Torpedon with me today, and he also has a YouTube channel, and it's linked in the description. Be sure to check him out. He deserves some love as well for uh, for doing this with me. Okay, let me just make a little uh, porch out here. It's just a floating lab, but that's okay. Oh no, that's the wrong type of grass. All right, there we go. I have the entrance to my lab. It's not looking that good, but I'll, I'll do that later, because, you know, I don't have time to fix the exterior. The interior is what's important here. Three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, and there we go. We are now connected to the underground. Guys, the last video I made with this uh, concept here, uh, the views weren't that good. It was actually going pretty slow, and I was like, wow, people really don't like this. I thought they would like it. But guess what happened then? For some reason, the algorithm was like, yup, this is good content, and then it got a thousand views in one day, which is really cool. So, if you enjoy this video, uh, don't forget to leave a like and comment down below because it apparently helps with the algorithm a lot and uh, You know, I want as many people to see this as possible. I'm gonna call Torpedon and see how he's doing. Hello, is this Torpedon I reached? Yes, it is. How's it going? Pretty well, pretty well. I'm actually trying my best here. It's kind of fun. Hey, nice. Yeah, it's really, How's it's really cool. I'm, I'm uh, good, I guess. I have an uh, idea and I'm trying to uh, to figure out what to do with it. Yeah, the thing is with this mod is that like it adds so many possibilities. But in the end, if yeah. you don't have a like an idea on what to do with it, it's it's, it's shit. Hard. Yeah, it's really hard to make yeah, something. Exactly. It's not like because there are other mods that add things to the game, like that you can use mm. new blocks and expanded redstone abilities and stuff, and they're pretty easy to work with. But this literally only adds portals, so you still have to use the core Minecraft mechanics to yeah, make exactly. something good. You need to know what to do. Yeah, exactly. All right, guys. So I made my first room with test subject number one. This is a creeper. Uh, and obviously you have to keep your distance so he doesn't blow up. Uh, but I haven't made anything more here. I just wanted like a room to fill out something you can look into and there's just like creeper sitting in there. Uh, but in here I want to make like a potion room. Because it's a lab, you know, they research things. And I want them to research potions as well. This mysterious thing in the Minecraft world which can give you effects that are inhuman. How does it work? Well, this lab are doing research on it, trying to figure out just that. So this will be the first potion room. I think I wrote test job. Let's do uh, potion room number one. What can we do? Can we make something here with the immersive portals mod? I think if we... Ooh, yeah, I might have an idea. Wait, so if we do this... How long is that? One, two, three, four, five, six, one, two. Six, one, two. Okay, let's go down here. One, two, three, four, five, six, one, two. Let's light this up. We should. Yes, indeed, we are now connected up here. So looking through here, we'll see down there. Yes, this is exactly what I wanted. And now, there we go. So now when you look into this, you see somewhere. Oh, that's cool. That is really nice. That's exactly what I wanted. 
If we make this bigger than it is in there, if we look into here, we should see... Oh yeah, look at that. That is really cool. What? I love that. Let's actually place the redstone lamps over here as well. So it looks like there's... Oh yeah, that's cool. What? I love it! Oh my god! I think I need to light it up on the outside though. Because you can see the portals really clearly if there's a different light level on the other side. And yeah, look at that! Wow! Oh, this is so cool! I'll play some glass panes. And I can see into this thing that's longer on the inside than on the- Oh, I love this mod so much! So, this will be our speed test chamber. Nice! What? This is so awesome! Alright guys, so I've made a room in here, but I didn't show you that because uh, I want you to have a surprise as well when I'm showing this to uh, Torpedon. But right now, I'm going to make the last room of this entire build, which will be a portal room. Yeah, after this room here, I am finished and you're going to get to see both mine and Torpedon's builds. I'm really excited to show you like all of these. These videos are so fun to make, uh, especially like in the end of them when you get to show what you've done. All right, and if you press this button, yes, that is so cool. Oh, I love it. That's basically the activator for the portals, but they're they're already activated, obviously. But I'm oh, that's so cool. All right, I think that's it for this build. Yeah, I'm finished. Uh, we've been building for one hour and one minute now, so almost exactly one hour, and this is what I've been able to make in that time. Smaller than I thought, but I guess this mod is also kind of complicated and it takes quite a long time to figure out how you can build what you want to build. All right, so Torpedon is here with me now outside of the H-Lab. And I'm going to show right. you what I've made. Yeah. So yeah, just uh, step inside and firstly, we're going to meet Lars, our receptionist here. Uh, Lars is a nice guy. This is like the third Lars we've had, though, because the Larses tend to die for some reason. We, we're doing some some dangerous things in this lab, so yeah, this is our Lars the third. So there we have another one. Uh, yeah, there's oh two my. Larses now. Oh no! Two Lars, one boat. <laughs> <laughs> two Lars, one boat. Oh no, two Lars, one boat. Yeah. Um, yeah. <laughs> All right, so if you walk down this uh, hallway here, uh, first we'll reach the speed test chamber. So uh, we've been studying potions for quite a while. And in All this right. little tunnel here, uh, you can walk around it and see. So in this lab, we have managed to create a speed potion. A potion that gives you speed. Uh, okay. And this is our, our, our chamber where we tested. We haven't tested it on humans yet, but it seems to work on the silverfish. Uh, if you press the button on your right there, there's the sound, it works, and yep, there we go. So now, oh as my. you can see, they have Swiftly speed, now. yeah, they are they have swiftness, so we've managed to create it, this is our, our tunnel for testing it. Alright, so on the other side here we have test subject number one, this is a creeper, you can go inside it, but please keep your distance, because he blows up. And uh, we've tried to figure out why they blow up, but we can't really seem to get it, because every time our researchers go up to him, he, he blows up. Blows up, yeah. Yeah, it's kind of hard. So we're trying to fix some way to, to study him, but yeah, for now, this is the most dangerous room we have. And up Big here, boy. we have the fire resistance test room. And to go here, you need to get your, your suit uh, to be safe. It's kind of, it's quite a, quite a dangerous oh. place down there. All right, there we go. Okay. Uh, so as you can see here, it's authorized personnel only, but I'm, uh, I'm giving you permission to walk through here. So this is a Thank portal you. we've Thank managed to, to get. And if we walk through here, we are now oh, in a dimension oh called the nether that we've found. So first we need to clean off. So go into here. This is cool. Hello? <laughs> Hello. Yeah, there we go. And uh, then you can just leave it. And uh, see, the nether is filled with lava. And we've mm -hmm. tried to create potions of fire resistance that would really enable us to, to swim in this lava. And we've done a lot of research on it, but right now it doesn't seem to work. Whatever we do, we've tried putting it in the lava. We've tried injecting uh, people with it. Uh, that's what we did to Lars too, and that's yeah, that's why he's dead. If we then walk into here again and clean ourselves off, yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, uh, let's get up to the overworld again, and don't forget to uh, take off your clothes now because they are they might be infected. We don't really know what we're dealing with down there. 
the last room of the day is our portal room. And if you press uh -huh. the button there, Bonk. we have oh now my. activated our portals. So now, if I walk through here, I arrive over here. Oh my. And like that. Can I try it? Uh, yes, you can. You might, get, uh, you might get stretched. There's this thing. Okay, Lars number one. We put him through here, and he got stretched, and it was really weird. Might happen to you, but if you if you feel like doing it, then sure. Yeah, so just, uh, yeah, walk through it. Okay. And now, if... Oh, no. Oh, no. What's, what's wrong? <laughs> you're, so, you're, the pu you're the Putin meme. The wide Putin meme. Oh, my. Yeah, <laughs> yeah but, but we have it fixed. Fix yeah, yeah, just walk through again. It, it, it oh, should work. Okay. Did it work? Oh yeah, it did. Nice, nice. Ah, I would like to work here. Is the do you have any? Do you have any positions? Uh, let's see here. Um, yeah. The position as Lars has opened up for some reason. So. Uh, ah. Yeah. You. Thank you very much. Just nice. Oh. Welcome yeah. to the lab. Uh, goodbye. <laughs> oh no, murder weapon. Uh, bye. <laughs> All right, torpedo. So, uh, is this your build? Uh, yeah, welcome to the shit build. <laughs> hey, <laughs> it's probably so, good. Uh, we're gonna go up in here. Okay, so to the left here we got um, yeah illusions. <laughs> hey, here's the Nether, what's oh! called, Nether World farm. It's like we're uh, <clears throat> testing out Nether World and its um, capabilities in uh, you know medicine and stuff. So, but it's uh, kind of. Uh, you know, cobwebby and stuff because people have died here. Oh, we don't we think it's radioactive or something. Oh, no, oh, I'll just, I'll just, I'll just back off then. Okay, but wait, why can I? Basically, we're dead. I can see you through here. That's really cool. Yeah, uh, somehow I think it's possessed. Uh, might be that that's might be why. It's just there's something wrong with the war. I'll just, I'm just gonna back off. Okay, this, <laughs> yeah, yeah, let's say uh, let's get <laughs> it's, so it's, to the left here. We have um, the bedroom, you know, something nice, looks like, like a jail you know. cell, but yeah, cozy. Basically, yeah, I was grown up in a jail cell. So oh, yeah, so that's where you... Yeah, nice. Okay, I get it. Yeah. Here we have... Um, here's the normal world, as we saw before. And uh, to the right... That is really cool, though. You think? Yeah, that's oh, really cool. Lot, that's really... So, yeah, you see the nether through here in the real world. That's awesome, man. This is another, like, test chamber, but this time it's uh, blocked off, so you won't die in here. All right, good. So so this won't kill me? I can <laughs> no, all? You're, you're safe in here. So this is... Um, I think it's a tunnel. I mean, yeah, you'll see. Just follow me. It's really weird. So, okay. you see, we're. These things don't usually grow in the normal world. So, I guess we're somewhere like outside the normal world. Yeah. But if we go deeper down, which is like weird, you'll see we end up in a cave. Oh, whoa. Oh, what? So, short summary. I'm mind boggled, but here I assume the people who used to work here were like getting and grabbing ores and stuff uh, from the caves here. Wait, this is really and, cool! Uh, what? Uh, Man, this is awesome. You said this was a shit. Okay. This is not shit. This is so cool. I mean, it doesn't really have a story behind it. It just like. But that uh, doesn't matter. You've never, like, you've never used this mod at all. Yeah, that's. It's your first place. time, and you you built this, and you go through under the cave and the mine carts. I love the mine carts. Yeah, the chest so. minecarts here. Oh, yeah, this is really awesome, man. Good job. All right, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you welcome Torpedo to the channel. This is his first video with me here. Check out Torpedo's channel. It's linked in the description below. And uh, yeah, like if you enjoyed the video. I'll see you in another one. Goodbye.